Well, well, my dear Lady Lucia. Quite a way home, uh, quite a way from home, aren't we? Please do excuse my sudden visit, Your Grace. Prince Lean, Lady Leth, this is Lord Ludwig, Duke of Felray. I was thinking that our Lagu's guest might enjoy the fine fruits that this region is known for. We've traveled quite a long way. I hope it won't be too much trouble. Don't be ridiculous. I could be nothing but delighted by a visit from you, Lady Lucia. Although I must admit, I'd be all the more pleased if you had come such a long way just to see me. You are too kind, Lord Ludwig. Please, feel free to take your ease. You're welcome to stay in Felray as long as you desire. I... I can't really get a read on him. Hey there, people. My name is Tagori, and welcome back to more uh, Fire Emblem. <laughs> hey, that looks creepy. This is it. This document is an order written by Ludwig himself, marked with his signet. If we show this to the Royal Assembly, we'll surely have the backing to indict him. In indict him. Thank you so much, both of you. We have to quell this uprising before things get out of hand. If there is no war, we are happy. But if there is war, it is good we came. Ludwig is poor prey. He hides behind a shield of words, not realizing that words can be seen through. Yes, and that's quite fortunate for us. But we still have to get out of here without being detected. My lady, you mustn't raise your voice. Who's there? Show yourself. Princess Lean, Sir Nelucci. I thought you had returned to the royal palace. What in the world are you doing out here? Oh, forgive us. We just couldn't help but be concerned for you. Well, what can I say? This just means we'll have to be even more careful to get out of here safely. Someone is coming. Guards? This cave has only one exit. I guess that means we do this the hard way. We've obtained enough evidence to indict, indict Ludwig, so there's no point in sticking around. Let's go. Okay, so it looks like things are dark. How far can I see out? Oh god. I can just barely see the path, I think? Yeah. Uh, but there's a dude right here. <sighs> um. Oh, okay, I don't get to rearrange him. It's just go. Well, that sucks. Can't transform. Can't transform. This sucks! <laughs> uh, where can Brom go? He can go over there. Do you have... No, you don't. Okay. Well, you got the Spectre card. Maybe I should use that. 100% chance to hit for five. Whatever, it's experience. Blarg! Okay. Oh, good thing he can get here. Steel axe. Ooh. Guaranteed kill on this guy, might as well. Okay. Looks like she has a wind sword. Oh, a parody? Cancels terrain support and skill bonuses to rely on tactics alone. Curious. Alright, whatever. Okay! And he's left with one. Darn. Wait, you have Galdir. Gl gl Gladir. I wonder what she has, though. Well, I messed up anyway, so... Whatever. And that's going to be it.
Okay, so we currently only have like three good units. <laughs> Heather, I don't know how much she can do. Um, what can she steal? Vulnerary? What can she steal from this guy? Nothing. I apparently can't see him or something? That's a chance to take a lot of damage. Okay, so we've only got these first four to really do any damage. These guys need to charge up a little bit. And Lane, I actually don't even want her <laughs> to get involved with anything. Uh, so what can I do? I want to see this parody in action. I don't know what it does. Okay, she can take out this guy, no problem. Poke and poke. And that's going to reveal another couple of squares, I guess. Is there any terrain bonuses? Terrain support and skill bonuses. That doesn't actually sound useful <laughs> right now, unfortunately. It's 16. Also, 18% chance to hit? Get hit? Okay. Um... I'm pretty afraid to just push too far forward. I would like to explore with Heather, but... I'm afraid. Okay, well... That's unfortunate. Uh... Wait, she's got Gladiator. What does this do? Figure. Okay. She can only hit one. Alright, whatever. I hope this guy doesn't have a longbow. Oh, I can see their items! He's got a torch! Is it worth taking him out? Easy. So, I have a torch. What does Talisman do? Increases resistance by two. Okay. So, I can use this. Light up a 
big area. Which still makes me wonder what was down here. So if he goes here, she can do this. Who do I have to take out uh, armored units? Anyone? Yes, okay. Um, we'll go off. I mean, maybe these guys, after they get uh, built up? I can absolutely just go around them, which might be the thing to do. Uh, I just want to check your items. You don't have a hammer, which would be nice. Let me put you down here. 16, 20, 6, and 12. Good. Very nice. So I do want Brahm and Nephany to build up a um, support system. So I, I think they need to be like within four, which is still a ridiculous amount of distance. Also, Leaf, Leth, she is uh, fully charged. I'm not gonna wanna do I'm not gonna wanna revigorate Braum. Maybe Lucia. Okay, it's gonna kill. With a dodge. So I'll move Mordecai. No. Uh. Nalucci. And then I can Gladiar Lucia. Finish moving here. And Lucia. That extinguish is gonna get me. <laughs> Guaranteed. Alright. didn't move. Bowgun. Level up. Perfect. And weapon level up. So that is great. And this entire time, I'm still far enough away. Uh, to where they can't be hit by anything.
easy. Easy kill. And I don't have to waste any durability on a really strong weapon, i.e. the uh, silver sword. Oh my god. Mirage. Oh my god. Well, that's fun. I'm pretty sure Naluchi can deal some damage. Ow. Uh, to those armored units. Just, uh, you know, probably getting him to them. Uh huh. Bronze knife. Oh, that's even worse. So. Mmm. Dang. 17. Is everyone just like two points away or something? I hope this is going to take him out. <laughs> if not, yes, it will. Okay. Just got hit for six, but that's not too bad. I've got a lot of HP on, on these characters. And a Volinary. So that's definitely going to help. Use that. Uh, steel axe, steel sword. What is the spear good against? Not the axe. Which does mean it's good against the sword. 59% to get hit for 8. But there is also the guy behind? I wonder also. No. Okay, just two damage? It's awful! Oh no, I'm dumb. I'm like, I want to stay two from this guy, but I forgot it doesn't count diagonally as being one. It counts it as being two. Ha! Ah. He's got a short axe? That could be good to give to Braum. Basically, I got a one-third percent chance. One-third chance to get hit. There it is. That's the word. That's the phrasing. Yep, and we can still move. Just gonna wait there. And let's see if I can actually trade him for that short axe. Got a steel axe. I'm gonna do 22, and never mind. I'm gonna do 33 <laughs> in one hit. Um, uh, right there looks good. Okay. Oh my God, you have that as well. You're hearing. You're hearing. I... Man, I just need to... <laughs> I need to look at my abilities. Uh... Alright, so, Nialuchi. What do you got? You got 12. That's garbage. What about you? 10. This isn't going to be able to even touch him. Yeah. Although, that was the weak one. What about the strong... <laughs> There's no such thing as a strong one, is there? 
Smite. Assign it to an adjacent unit to move it two spaces away. Alright, cool. Don't care. Fang. That's more like it. 74% chance to get hit for nothing. So it's 18. I mean, I could just go straight for this guy. As long as he can move one, that's good. Maybe he can't. So one, uh, one, two, three, four. What is his move? Where is it? Eight. Okay, yeah, he's good. <laughs> Ow. Gets the kill. And so does she. Well, look what we have here. Lady Lucia and her pack of curs. How interesting. What could co uh, what cause could you have for roaming the grounds at night, hmm? Cause? Why, we've merely lost our way. Is that so? In that case, I will gladly escort you back to the castle. That's quite all right. We should be going home, but please do give Lord Ludwig a message. Tell him that his revolt will never succeed. <laughs> I did try to warn Lord, Lu Lord Ludwig, but it seems that he's quite fond of you. If you knew of our little discovery, I'm certain he would have no qualms about eliminating you. It doesn't kill. All right, watch this. I have a backup plan in case my primary plan didn't work here. Yeah, so my primary plan is this. Yeah, perfect. As I expected, the queen's house pets are playful little pups indeed. The only thing you're sniffing about will get you, however, is an abruptly shortened lifespan. As he dies immediately. <laughs> My death means nothing. Our plan is perfect. There is nothing. Nothing the Queen can do. He almost went Shatner there. There's nothing the Queen can do. Alright. All we needed to do was beat the boss. So we, uh, we did that. Castle Crimea. Castle Crimea. C Castle Crimea River. As we suspected, Ludwig is intent on rebellion. His followers are spread across the land, inciting insurrection. We have the documents to prove it. Queen Alincia, I stand ready to defend the realm. I will lead the royal knights into Felray, and we will seize the duke. I am hesitant to resort to the sword without at least attempting diplomacy. At all costs, I must stop the people of Crimea from fighting one another. Your Majesty, news from the countryside. Duke Ludwig has assembled an army and announced its intentions against you. The rebellion in Felray is growing quickly. I see. He must have realized his operations were no longer a secret. Your Majesty, we have no time to waste. We must stand against this for the future of Crimea. I understand. Jeffrey, leader of the Royal Knights, I hereby authorize the use of military force against the rebel army. Yes, your majesty, at once. I will begin marshalling forces. This rebellion must be stopped before nobles in surrounding areas catch wind of it. Am I doing the right thing? Oh, father, Uncle Renning. Sometimes a hard choice must be made. Welcome back, Marcia. Did you learn of Sir Ike's whereabouts? 
No, I'm sorry. I've got nothing but sore feet and a tired pegasus. I've talked to a few local villagers who said the Grell mercenaries have been working low-paying odd jobs here and there. Nobody seems to know where they are. But everyone agrees that this is the first time they've been gone for so long. Princess Lean, please try to keep your spirits high. I assure you, we will continue to investigate Sir Ike's whereabouts. Th thank you. Oh, Princess Lean, you spoke! In quite a shock, yes? My lady has been studying a language which we often call modern speech. That's wonderful. It's hard enough visiting a strange land, let alone learning the language. Me, not big. No p problem. Queen Alencia had tr trouble heart. Ah, I'd forgotten. The Heron tribe can peer into the heart. I can't hide the pain I'm feeling, at least not from you, Princess Lean. Queen Elencia. Why does this happen? My people fight, brother against brother, and no matter what I do, I can't stop it. I'm a miserable failure. I would just want to crawl into a cave somewhere. How can anyone believe in me now? I never asked for any of this. I never wanted to be queen. I can't do it anymore. Chapter 3 Jeffrey's Charge. So I can shop. What is in my armory? I can buy a wind edge? It's pretty good. Steel blades. What is the difference between blades and swords? So let's see. B, C. More damage. Less accurate and heavier. So typically just heavier weapons are less accurate anyway. That is a lot of accuracy loss. Wow. So it almost seems like iron blades might just be the best choice. Iron Whatever. <laughs> Hand axes are good. Pole axe? Steel knives and daggers. All three elements. Is there anything fun here? Horse slayer? That's fun. Killer lance? Killing Edge, Killer Axe, all- I want all of this. I literally want all of this. So, the killer or killing stuff has extremely high crit rate. Let's see here, crit 30% as opposed to everything else is zero. Uh, so yeah, that uh, definitely is fun. Uh, Horse Slayer? Anything that is mounted takes bonus damage. Hammer is armor. Longbow is extra range. So this is two or three. I could probably sideline the longbow. Killer axe would be very nice. Killer lance as well. These could go on um, Brahm and Nephany, respectively. I wonder if they're still with me. I can check this. Support? Yes. Nope. I don't know any- <gasps> Makalov! Oh, I remember this guy! I don't know why, but he seems like a character. He reminds me of a character that I saw in an anime. I don't remember what anime it is, though. I just know that I liked this guy. So I had to have seen that anime way back in 20... What? 14-ish? 20... 13? I don't remember. Marsha. Um, Astrid. 
Oh, she is. Um, how do I? <laughs> how do I look at my units? Here we go. All right, so Jeffrey is mounted. He's a lance paladin. Only uses his lance. Kieran is an axe paladin, also mounted. You are a bow paladin. And everyone is just a paladin. Everyone is mounted. Okay. <laughs> you can have swords. Again, I'm not going to pay attention to any of these. I'm just going to go right through it. A Brave Lance. Ooh. Love that. Silver Axe. Um. Okay, good. You do have an Iron Longbow. That's very nice. You have a coin. Go ahead and drop that in there, then. Wait, who is this? Danvid? What? Just a halberdier? A killer lance. That is nice. Gonna have to use that sparingly. You could definitely use something better. Your A, so I won't have to worry about it. I will give everyone two weapons, so Makalov is really the only one that I need to buy for. If I don't, these rotate out every, um, after every mission, this tab specifically. Um, so if I don't buy them, they'll go away. But this is a lot of money I'm spending. Killer bow is incredible. I'm definitely going to buy this. And even if I don't use it on Astrid, <laughs> which I hope that I don't have to, Hammer is just good all around because it's strong against armored units, and that's like the only way to really do a ton of damage to him. Killing Edge. You know, I honestly wasn't intending to just go buy all of the, buy this stuff on camera, but here I am. Or Slayer. Still great lance. I, mean, I can technically just buy all of it. What did I pick up? <laughs> this is Killer Axe, right? Yeah, okay, good. my money. <laughs> I'm not going to do it. Not doing it. Um, does anyone have a support? No, of course they don't. Right, because I haven't used these characters. I'm dumb. Right, mostly I was just stalling out time to end the episode. <laughs> so, with that, I hope you've been enjoying this. And please join me again for another episode of Fire Emblem.